A Noblesville woman says she got this severe foot infection after getting a pedicure. RTV 6's Stephanie Wade spoke to that business that says it's not their fault and to the woman who spent several days in the hospital. Jennifer White wanted to treat her daughters to a spa day. They went to a local nail salon to get their nails done. Little did she know her pedicure would land her in the hospital for the next week. I was worried I could possibly lose my toe. I could lose my foot. Um, I'm out of work. I can't work. I'm, you know, all for 35 minutes of getting a pedicure. Almost two weeks ago, White got a pedicure here at Nails and Lounge in Noblesville. In the following days, she noticed her foot swelling up and turning purple. She was admitted to the hospital last Tuesday. And I am still here. And they are saying it's due to the fact that I've had, you know, went to the nail salon and the, the scrapings and things like that caused probably a small incision somewhat and unclean, unsanitary, and it's made the infection settle in my foot. According to the Indiana Administrative Code, the use of razor devices to shave, reduce, or remove calluses or corns is prohibited. The spa says they did not use any prohibited devices. You know, I want people to be aware that this can happen to them, you know, and it happens so fast. Now, I spoke with the manager, and she says they sanitize and dispose of all tools properly according to state law. She also says they bleach the pedicure tubs after every use. But after this experience, now they have ordered plastic liners for each of the pedicure tubs to ensure there is no spread of infection in the future. Reporting in Noblesville, Stephanie Wade, RTV6. The spa says although they deny the infection was caused by their pedicure, they are open to working with the customer to pay for her medical bills.